Oh, what's this? Well, this would be a snowblower. An electric snowblower, a lithium snowblower. Two stage. I don't need that. Don't need that. Oh, probably gonna need these. That's right. Look at that battery pack. Not one, but two. 80 volts. That is a beefy battery pack. Double charger. That's nice. Looks like it comes mostly complete. Looks like we just have our chute right here and maybe a couple little knobs to attach our handles. But even our handles are pre-wired and everything. I just got to screw them on. And there we go. Auger clearing thing. We're just flipping open a lid. Lock in one battery. And these battery packs they actually use on, they have a single stage version of this, a chainsaw, um, a lawnmower that uses these same battery packs. But clip those in, put down the little cover, and get that locked in. Put the key in. Looks like we got headlights. Yeah, two little headlights. You can point them, just some LED bulbs, nice. And it looks like we got a few forward speeds, three forward speeds, and a reverse. And this is probably a master shutoff. Yep. So that's nice. So let's fire up the uh, the auger, which would be this side. There's this little safety switch. I have to turn the light off for this. I saw these little these little clear panels down here. And they, I wondered why they were clear, if you could inspect a belt or something. And it looks like you can. So you can see a little um, cogged belt in there. But they put L blue LEDs in there on both sides, almost as a, uh, like a safety light. So if you're snow plowing or something, people can actually see you from the side. That's pretty dang cool. Just little things like that. I like that. It looks like a spaceship. Sounds like a spaceship. Metal impeller. Serrated, uh auger blades, cast aluminum gear housing, very standard. So let's fire that up. It's kind of kind of neat, it kind of um, locates itself on the motor and then goes. Must have like a sensor or something. It's a brushless motor. Snow Joe emailed me a couple of weeks ago about this and I read the email and I was actually pretty excited because this is the very first two-stage lithium powered snowblower that I've ever seen. Um, as far as I know it's the only one on the market and I could be wrong but running off these same batteries they use in their other system and I think they have a single stage snowblowers they've had for years that run off just a single 40 volt where this runs off dual to make an 80 volt so Pretty excited about it. Seems to have a good amount of torque and everything else. So I want you guys to tell me what I should do. It's a little pre-snow season, but once snow does fall, I'd love to hear from you guys what you think, what you want to see it do. Um, of course, I'll test it out in the snow. But if there's anything else you guys want to see about it or see it do, let me know. I'd be happy to do it. Here's all the specs off the box, and I'll put a link below where you can see online all the details on it. But Sounds pretty impressive, up to a 40 minute run time, 1,000 pounds per minute, 24 inch swath. Should be a pretty good machine, we'll find out. Um, besides burnouts, right? We'll do a burnout.
every good snowblower should do a burnout. Let's see. Put it in three. It's already on. Yeah! Yeah, it'll do a burnout. 